The Fokker D7 is widely regarded as the best German fighter aircraft of World War I. The D7F, in particular, is what really stood out and was arguably the best high altitude performing aircraft of the war. This variant was equipped with the BMW 3A engine, which was a high compression inline engine. Its pistons compressed the fuel air mixture much more than a normal engine, allowing it to produce greater power, especially at altitude. To manage it, there was another throttle inside the cockpit called the altitude throttle. Unlike a normal throttle, the altitude throttle regulated the flow of thin air into the engine. As the aircraft climbed, the pilot would gradually open it, allowing the engine to maintain full power even as air density decreased. While most Allied engines lost significant power with altitude, the D7F could sustain its performance, giving it a huge advantage over other aircraft. However, the only downside was that at low altitudes, the engine couldn't run at its maximum power because if it did, too much dense air would enter, causing the mixture to ignite too early, which would quickly damage the engine. By the end of the war, more than 3,000 Fokker D7s were produced, and about 25-30% to 30 of them were fitted with the BMW engine.